the E-World system was created for all DX and distributors. Previously, DX and US distributors had to log into two systems. Autotrack, to place their order, and E-World to view their PPV. Now, they only need to log into one system, which is E-World. These are some of the functions that will be available in E-World for all US distributors. To begin, first you need to activate your E-World account. On the E-World page, click on First Time Login. Enter the distributor code that was given in the welcome letter you had received when you click to register as a distributor. Then click Confirm. Key in your date of birth and email, then click Request Code. Please make sure the email you have entered here is valid and up to date as the activation code will be sent to this email. Retrieve the activation code from your email and enter it here. Then, key in a password of your choice. The password must be a combination of alphanumeric characters and must be 8 to 12 characters in length with no symbols. Key in the same password again, then click Submit. Now, you have activated your account, and can use all the features of eWorld. One of this is Online Purchase. Click US Online Purchase. You have two choices, Regular Order and IOC Order. For Regular Order, first, select the product category, then select the product you want to buy. And click the Shopping Cart. You can choose to continue shopping, or if your shopping is done, click View Card. If you want to buy more products, click Continue Shopping, otherwise, if you have finished shopping, click Checkout. The shipping information will then appear. Please make sure the shipping address is correct, as the products will be sent to the address stated here. Next is the Payment. These are your payment options. This is the option for the packing list. Click here if you want to include the packing list, which won't generate the invoice until you have confirmed the details. Check through your order, and if the details are correct and confirmed, click on Charge Now to generate the invoice. For IOC order, the related information, like your distributor code and your sponsor information, will be listed. Select the IOC package and sponsor I code, then click continue. The shipping information will appear. If the details are correct, click continue. Next, is the selection of products available for IOC redemption. You can select any product that is available under the select product list. And the quantity you wish to purchase. If you want more details about the product, Click on the product code, and the product description will appear. Once you have made your selection, click continue to proceed with payment. Select your payment option. If the order details are correct, click charge now, and the invoice will be generated. With eWorld, you can also register new members. Click Register New Member, and this page will appear, containing your information as sponsor. Your mailing zip code has to be correct, if not, you will be alerted by the system with an incorrect zip code notification. Read through the distributorship policies and procedures before clicking to agree. Fill in the information of the person you wish to sponsor. Tick this option to show your agreement. Then click Submit. A welcome letter will be generated containing information and details of the new member. Under this option, you can easily create your own personal website with no additional cost. Read through the policy, then click Accept and Proceed. You will then receive the link to your own personal website. 
This is an example of your personal website. It has your name and distributor code. For marketing purposes, you can give your personal website link to your prospects. Anyone who comes to this website and registers as a DXN distributor will automatically become your downline, which is a fast and easy way to grow your network. Another benefit of the personal website is retail purchase. Through this option, visitors to the personal website can directly buy products, and the product purchase transaction will come under the owner of the personal website. To purchase products, the customer has to key in their name, phone number, email, and zip code, before clicking continue. The customer can then proceed to select the products, and add to the shopping cart. The products purchased will be under the customer price and not the distributor price. Once done, click checkout. Confirm the shipping information. Then proceed with payment. Once done, invoice will be generated to the customer. You also have the option of enrolling under the AutoShip program. Once you have subscribed to AutoShip, the products you have selected will be automatically sent to you on a monthly basis. Read through the agreement, then click I agree. End of the payment and shipping information. Select the products for automatic shipment. For more information on the products, click on the product code. End of the shipping and payment details, then click update. You will receive this notification. There's an integration of information between the US website and eWorld. Any information that appears at the US website is also available in eWorld. For example, information at the news and events section of the DXN US website. The same information is also available at eWorld at DXN Hub under news and events. While for Travel Seminar Incentive TSI, the same information is available at eWorld under the menu called Travel Seminar Incentive. The same for Promotions at the US website which is available at eWorld under Promotions. For the training schedule at the US website, the same information is available under DXN Hub training schedule at eWorld. The genealogy data is available in two types of viewing mode, list view, which is a list of downlines in rows, and tree view, with the data presented in a tree structure. This is the list of items under My Marketing. Click this box to hide the list, and view the data in full screen. Click the box to bring back the list of menu items. Under the list view, you can view the data through the following filter options. For example, PV and Country. Select the option, for example, Australia, then click View. The data will be displayed. The other option is generation 1 to 5 and 6 to 10. Ranking status from member to ESD. The data can also be displayed based on distributor status, whether active or inactive. You can choose the number of record to display per page from 10 to 50. The data can also be filtered through these options, for example, with personal PV. Once you have done your selection, click view. The data will be displayed. You can also do a specific search using the distributor's name or code. Just key in the name, 
click Find, and the data will be displayed. Click on the distributor code to view the cross-country PV purchase. Under the tree view, the filter options are PV and country. The ranking status. Distributor status and generation. Click view when you have made the selection and the data will be displayed accordingly. You can also choose the sequence for your data to be displayed, whether joint date or distributor name. Make your selection, click view, and the data will be displayed. Under tree view, click on the distributor's name to view the cross-country PV purchase. Manage your network by checking on your network's PV purchase status. Click on the member code for the current month's data. With the new enhancements, you can also view the PV purchase for the last 12 months. Click I for the breakdown of the PV purchase within the Europe region. New distributor listing is the list of newly recruited downlines. It is available here in list view. Click on I for the contact details of the newly recruited direct downline. The information is also available in tree view. The newly recruited direct downlines are highlighted in green. Under My Qualified Downline, you can manage your network by checking the status of your downline to determine if they have qualified for a certain status. Make your selection and click View. The data will be displayed. You can also do a specific search using the name or the code of the distributor. Key in the name, click Find, and the data will be displayed. My previous PPV qualification displays the finalized actual qualification data of your network. It lists out your total number of QSA and QSD. This report also shows the borrowed line, if there's any occurrence of borrowing, and your newly recruited downlines. For easier viewing of the data, there are a few filter options. PV in country, for example, Australia. Click view to display the data. You can also do a specific search by keying in the name and clicking find for the data to be displayed. Click on the distributor code for the PV purchase data and history, as well as the status, whether active or inactive. My achievement lists out your data for the three previous bonus months. It lists out your rank or status within the three months. It also lists out the PPV details by region and country. Click I for the breakdown of the PV purchase within the Europe region. Your monthly bonus for the three months is also listed. You can also view your total downlines by status and country. This report is directly synchronized with the online billing system OBS. This is the live current balance. You can now know your latest DSP balance without delay and without having to go to the branch to obtain the data. This is the PV purchase data for the past 12 months. The purchase status is represented by different colors. Active is green, less active, blue, not active, red, and moderate, orange. There are also options to filter the data. Generation, 1 to 5 and 6 to 10. 
Ranking status, example, member. Distributor status, whether active or inactive. And purchase status. Make your selection, click view, and the data will be displayed. You can also do a specific search using the name or code. For example, key in the name, click find, and the data will be displayed. For more details on the distributor, click the distributor code. Click I, for the breakdown of the PV purchase within the Europe region.